this short update quickly. As you can see behind me over there is rice or arroz con cosas ready for lunchtime today, which is day one of the Orphan Feria. And picking up some of that and back to the desk to try and make head or tail of the noble number five that needs to be finished really soon. And a super good evening. I'm here in the Plaza Bukharova village. It's ferry time. I got my 3,000 words done and I figured out a way using Google Drive to get the video footage from my phone to my computer. So this afternoon was the pro long and arduous process of transferring 45 videos from the phone to my computer via Google Drive one at a time. If I can figure out a way of doing this in bulk, it will make life so much easier. But for the meantime, I got all the video footage moved across to the computer now, which means that sometime over the weekend, I will start editing that footage together into videos and getting the uploads back up and running again. And then the important factor for tomorrow will be completing the new outline and getting those additional chapters written. I definitely won't have them finished by this Sunday, so definitely the final draft upload will be, or the final manuscript upload will be happening next week Sunday and for publishing on the 10th of October, but still getting my fifth book out by the 10th of October with hopefully the sixth book out by the 31st of October. Not too bad going, having six books out by the time we get to the end of month 10 of the year. Super short catch-up clip. I've got no idea where the other one cut out because the uh, my iPhone's memory was all of a sudden too full. But anyway, deleted a few things, opened up a little bit of space. But anyway, the basic gist is, got my words in, got all the video footage from the phone, transferred over to the computer, and tomorrow is going to be a day of trying to get a lid on the section of novel outlining that I need to do and right at the moment as I'm standing here I've got no idea how I'm going to do that, where it's going to be coming from but I'm needing to immerse my mind into the into the world of Cedar Ridge and listen to what my characters have to say but that's for tomorrow morning. Good night, speak to you bright and early.